Tony's mod time. It's mod time with Tony. Me, I'm Tony, and these are the mods. Mod time. All right, Giants again up early this morning, releasing a few mods, some updates, not a ton, but. We have an update to new mini brun. I kind of like this map, to be honest. 1.06. New save game, not mandatory. Well done for actually writing that in there. Thank you. A non visible collision at the cow shed, the price for pig feed. Visibility of some decorative elements. Remove the pizzeria point of sale from the shop. Tipping problems with the grapes. A newer system at the cow shed, the hunter lodge, can now be removed by cutting down the spruce next to it. Kind of like that. No new save game required, though. A lot of updates to this. Kind of like this because it's simple. It's small-ish. It's a decent map. All right, plant protection. We did. I didn't understand this one when it came out. Let's see what he did to it. This was this was more RP, RP if I remember correctly. Hose operation improved with filling. Change the capacity of the large bottles to 50 liters for better gameplay. Okay. I didn't quite get this. We tried it out. I didn't, I didn't get it. All right, we got an update to the MF274S in the Landini. Dashboard lighting, visual mistakes fixed, and new details added. These are not my favorite uh, tractors styles. I don't know why. It's, it's too square. Very square. All right. I know people have been waiting for an update on these. It's weird, man. Sorry. 1.2. Attach. Added tank attach node. So you can put tanks on these things now. Camera system compatibility. Door dampener sound. Rear hoses with the quick hitch. And an indoor camera shake with the Kubota DLC. Aren't these the ones that's going to be on the Connect modding map that comes out? What, Friday or something? I know they were favorite. I just, you know. We ate lead paint as a kid, too, back then. Doesn't mean it was good. Oh, this is not them? I thought it was the Carl Farms one that are going to be on that map. Thank you for, uh, thank you for using all your words there, Richard. All right, the Lizard Next gets an update. I kind of like this update because this is a good truck. This is a good solid mod hub truck for people. Yeah, I think it's Friday, right? Okay, they're doing a they're doing a South American configuration for that one. Fair. This is a good solid mod hub truck, and they've added. Oh, to DLC, which don't care, but they've added the five 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 seven and the four three two zero. The five 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 seven is the dump truck, and the four two three six is the timber truck. So, not only do you get the next, you get the dump version, or not the dump version, and the where's the timber one? And that show pick. There you go, timber one. Now the, the the dump truck is not that big, 10, 12, or 16, 6, eh. But this thing does go up to 600 horsepower, it says. It's 84 grand. Yeah, it's a solid mod up truck. Like if I, if, if you're, if you're on console and you just want to, you know, you're just using the mod up stuff, you can do worse than this truck. Cheap, powerful, and now it's got more bed options, so. All right, Scorpion King 1.1 1 .1 
continuous tone after update. I don't know what that means. Shop options enabled again, which is good. Let's just add some patch issues or something. All right, new stuff. This one came out. We talked about this one. This might be an all-platform release. I think this one came out on PC already. I remember discussing this one. But basically what this does, front loaders, rear loaders, and telehandlers with articulated steering allows the indoor camera to follow the front of the vehicle when you steer left or right, which is kind of cool. Here's your supported vehicles. Again, we showed the picture. There's your supported vehicles. So not really telehand. Well, like this is a telehandler, but you know. So this is with the mod on. So like you'll follow the front of your thing instead of looking this way. You'll look, you'll follow that. See, instead of facing this way, you're going to face that way. I think it's really cool. Not that I like using the articulated stuff, but I think that helps. I think that's the console release of that one. All right, we got another slurry tank. 19.5, 14 meter spread, holds 10,000 liters, 100 horsepower. I mean, got a lot of configurations, got maneuver system. It's a slurry tank. Is there a category that has more stuff than slurry tanks? I mean, we got five pages of slurry tanks. Congrats, Richard. All right, we got a luxury house. 85 grand, sleep function. People do like their shit. Yeah. Doesn't look like you can go in it. It's a nice pretty house. I'll take it. Yeah, I was kind of looking for an interior, but just looking through these windows, it looks like the graphics. Right? No hot tub? I know. Kind of, I mean, what luxury is? I have that. I have that installed, Richard. I was going to show that yesterday or today. Luxury is relative, right? All right, we got a groundwater pump. Five grand. I don't know what this does. Like, if you just get water from it. It's fine. I guess you just get water from it. All right, we got a Kinsey Mach 2 and Deagleman Pro Tail Pack. Disc Harrows. 7.9 meter and 12.2 meter. So pretty decent. 390 to 620 horsepower. So you need a lot of, lot of ponies. 108 grand is your max price there. Now, is he, see, that would be cool. A house with like turn on the TV, lights, that sort of thing. I don't know why people, like for me, going inside a house, I could care less. I don't need to go in, I don't need to have an interior of, the, of a house. I don't care. But I know that a lot of people like that. And I think, I think I blame Elk Mountain for that because they made such a beautiful house that everybody wanted a house like that. I don't know if they were the first, but that's the one I, everyone always mentions. So, a couple of big disc arrows. Yeah, he, I mean, it, you're not wrong. I agree with you. All right, we got a pallet racking pack. Two sizes shelves, keep pallets and bag organized. 1500 for the XL. 
1250 for the large, 950 for the small. I'm guessing these are auto load, right? It's like a pallet warehouse, but just a rack. Just kind of cool. It'd be, you know, it's cool for seeds and big bag, you know, like, but it doesn't, doesn't say it takes the seeds and like the big bags. I don't know. It's just pallets. Don't, I don't know how, why you would store like 10 pallets of stuff here. I don't know. If it takes big bags and stuff, it's fine, which I'm sure it does. It has to, right? Yeah, it says bags, so this would be good for seed and fert and stuff for it to auto load up in there. All right, we're going to do squiggles last because I did download it. I want to try it. Collect stones at missions. This has been out on like GitHub for a while. It, it basically lets you collect stones from your contracts. So if you do a plowing contract and you get stones, you can them, keep them, sell them, make money off it. I don't want to collect stones on my own field. I'm not collecting them on somebody else's field, but I have heard, not saying this is true, but I've heard that you can make an infinite amount of money by plowing and picking up stones. Just saying. So if you want to take your plow contract and make some stones from it, Steggy, we're talking about we're talking about the somebody released a short when when 22 came out of an infinite money hack. And they said plow your field, pick up the stones, plow your field again, pick up the stones, plow your field again, pick up the stones, and make infinite money. And it's gotten like two hundred thousand views. It drives me nuts, Stegman. Yeah, lime's, lime's good money. We're, we were making lime here with our stones and selling it, but a little bit different process, but... Yeah, the, the, the short was a joke. What's up, Loveweed? All right, Squiggles. Make sure you guys go give this a download. Give it a nice rating. Only got a couple ratings so far. Enhanced water adds the ability to have water as a fertilizer type to help your crops grow. A cheap solution for your crops to grow, you... Water. So water as a fert. Fix the dead zone. That's good. Now, I don't know if this is like the thing you sent me, Squiggles, with the uh, fill type. All right, this is just the fert part. But we're going to go, we're going to go look at it. But make sure you guys go check it out. Give it a nice rating. Help our boy Squiggles out. There's just links right there. Go start this game up and take a look at it. mods yeah yeah but you just use thunders mod you got two birds nice thunders mod and you have like a thousand fill types right Yeah, I understand squiggles though. I do. I get it. Two parakeets. Parakeets would keep me up at night. All right, let's get a fert spreader. Grab this one. This should work. Yeah, I know my uh so 
like I said, half my family is from New York, and apparently in New York, they like birds. Like the older generation always raised birds. They always had, everybody always had a bird in their apartment because it was one of the only things you could keep in an apartment, right? As a pet. Very, very used to hearing the birds chirping. What's up, Joe? Oh, really, Richard? That's exciting. Okay. That's not giving me water. I think that tank sucks. I think I've had issues with that tank before. Yeah, I, I, if it's Tony, 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 Tony has, has done, done it again. again. Big Joe, Big Joe, a shout out, please. If it's the one we were, we were talking about, uh, that's curious. I, I didn't say anything, so I, you know, I, I can't claim to have done anything. Thank you, Eric. Why can't I fill this up with water? Try it this way. All right. Do this. What's up, Apache? How you doing, sir? We got enhanced water on there. Let's try this one more time. All right, so that one doesn't, it doesn't say it takes water, Squiggles. Start the show. Oh, yeah, yeah. It doesn't take pee. Get this one. Yeah, I know. I know what Yuri is. You choo choo choose me? Dark Thorn, our anniversary. What did you get me? I don't know. It's not, it's saying. It's saying it doesn't take water. Dark Thorn, thank you for the resub, dude. I do appreciate it. So I'm fully prepared to say I'm doing something wrong. Thank you, Bach. Just drink water. Here you go.
Beaver Hollow. Yeah, that's a that's a decent map. Giggity. Yeah, so it's not adding that to a fill type. Okay, so yeah, it happens. Something something got the uh, you know mixed up in the in the process. I'm back. It's really cool. Like he did send it to me. He had he had bulk water as a as a fill type. So like literally you could put water in a trailer like this. But apparently Giants didn't like that idea. So something, something got a little wonky with that in the uh, implementation. Wiggles is on it. So we will move on to play. Nice pledge. Thank you for, for that. I appreciate it. Four months. Beautiful. Legacy sent us some stuff. Joking again. So this was a Western Iowa mod that Legacy got permission to. <laughs> Shut up, go. <laughs> go. Thank you, Oki. Ah, oh, that didn't count for the hype train. <laughs> So these were Western Iowa mods that Legacy got permission to finish. We have cold storage, two cold storage. Now there's only one color changeable part on these because apparently in Blender that's how they were made. And Legacy couldn't didn't want to like re-blender it. So you have the 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 white here. And you can change. I know it's crazy. Oh, well, there it is. Fox got the anarchy started. Uh, the plumber depends if is it a dedicated server or like the the multiplayer game you're trying to join. Yep. Apparently we got anarchy approved. How many beans we got to eat today? So this one changes the the buildings. Yes. Thank you, Oki. Right. So you can change the building color. This one. It's the black roof. So you got a white roof and a black roof. Yeah, if it's a, if it's a dedicated server like G Portal or the other places, but don't go to the other places. Then yes, that's the whole point of it. You can get on if they're not there. If it's a multiplayer game that they start up, then no, the person has to be on. So black roof, white roof, right? We can change the color. So this down and there's legacy's links make sure you go give him some support oops there we go. All right. The doors on these are pretty awesome. I, I don't know if I've seen like a hydraulic door like this. I think maybe those gigantic barns had these, but I kind of like these. And yes, you can put a tractor on top of there. It will hold it. But these barns are gorgeous. They did it. Western Iowa did a really good job and Legacy did an excellent job finishing them up. Got a light switch. They hit the lights. These will be released soon. They're not out yet, but they will be released soon. They're in testing. I couldn't find anything wrong with them. I tried to I tried to find stuff wrong with it last night and couldn't, so. Really gorgeous barns. Pretty big, too. So you got two options there. 
0 0.05 bigger. I'll uh, I'll pass that on to Legacy. I'll pass it on. Yeah, there's some weight clipping through the tin, but you know. Oh yeah, I I sent him one thing that like you nobody even noticed. I I did have to do one thing, Schultz, because I can't just say it's perfect. I did pick out one thing, and sent it to him. And I'm like, I'm just being a dick. Nobody will even notice it, but yeah, you wanna you wanna you know, you put it down on top of a field. Yeah, you're gonna get some wheat clipping through, but I'm not worried about that at all. Now another thing he's worked up is a pack of some other sheds so right here he's got his implement sheds he's got an 8 a 10 and a 12 bay and these things are pretty gorgeous this is the big boy now these are multiple color options do that so there's your colors for that Let's just do red so we can see it. And then we have our roof. Uh, I don't know, Bach. I don't think so. That's a good idea, but I don't think so. I know, I know Schultz has access to Legacy. I'm just, I was being facetious when I said that. Well, that save save that save that thought, Schultz, because I got a I got a mod that I couldn't figure out last night. So save that thought. See, when I say I'll pass that along to him, I'm basically telling Schultz to pound sand. Like that's that's what I meant by that. So that changes your trim. So, really, really well done. And if you remember, like, I think we showed these once before. The shadows on these things are phenomenal. The lighting that Legacy does is phenomenal. But these would be a pack with the 8, 10, and 12... And this lights up at night. The leg, the the logo, and the these outside lights light up. Really beautiful at night. Here, I'll show you at nighttime. You're disappointed in my memory. See, Schultz, it's more psychology. I'm involving you in what I'm going to be doing later. It's called it's called participation. It's called engagement. Since you're, you know, a big time streamer now, you need to, to learn this stuff. So yeah, pretty gorgeous at night. Shut up, goats. And apparently we missed the train, too. But thank you guys for getting the train started. I appreciate it. Thank you for laughing at me, Oki. So a nice pack of three. There's your ten bay. Really gorgeous stuff. And he sent me a picture of something else he's working on that's gigantic, number one, but it's gorgeous. They are rude goats. So really well done by Legacy there. Again, go check him out. Thank him for sending this over. Hopefully these get passed soon. All right, so before Schultz forget, I found these metal sheds. These things are really cool. This one's 18 by 36. And I'll, I'll make it daytime again here, but. I 
I could not figure out how to make these work. Now, they say they have no collisions on the doors, but that they will open for realism. So this one has a collision. This one has no collision. But I can't figure out how to open the doors. Oh, the light worked today. The light didn't work on the other one. I can't figure out how to open the door, but it says open object options, storage metal. And it gives me the sell or rename. But I can't, oh, this did not work for me last night. Interesting. Never mind. None of this worked last night. The lights didn't work, the door didn't open. Try again. Let's try the bigger one. Maybe I didn't use that one. Now this one is huge and it's got side doors. Yeah, I don't know. It just didn't work yesterday. Apparently, it's apparently working tonight. I don't know if I had a conflict or something. I don't know. Yeah, once I think once you get the doors open, it's fine. You know what I mean? Get the doors open and leave them like the, the hopping in there like that. It's kind of weird. Yeah, they are kind of bunker ish. Happy they're working today. And I don't know why they didn't work yesterday, but they do now, so. So yeah, you do have like a like a hump there. I don't know if that's gonna mess with the tractor too much. Yeah, you could fill it with potatoes. That would be good for that or rain or something. Supplies. I think it would actually be a cool pallet storage. Planes. Yeah, there are a few. Like, uh, there are some sprayer mods for helicopters. They don't always work that great, but... Yeah, that is a big hump. Yeah, I don't think you're going to store a lot of wide stuff in there because these doors aren't that big, but... I wonder if we can fix that hump. maybe better if we took our time we could make it better but yeah little hump there no like but i think the look of them are fantastic i really like the look of these these things and now that they actually work i'm very happy i'm, I'm just confused as to why they didn't work last night like i didn't get that action light out thing i didn't get closed gate open gate so I just like the look of them. Nope, not gonna happen. It's kind of missile silo like, isn't it? All right, so our last sheds of the day, I found these. These are pretty cool as well. These are, this is a hoop barn bale storage. 
I mean, it's just basic hoop barn, but again, really cool look. You've got with no wall in the back. You've got the two slot storage with or without the wall in the back. So again, you could store grain or something in here. Potatoes in here. Bales. Whatever. This is the bale one, but I don't know. These things look awesome. Yeah, I'm a fan of a hoop barn. I really am. I kind of like the concrete one with the with the bays because then you can either separate equipment or, like you said, store things in here. No, these are these are PC only. They're not on the mod hub. These were on uh, uh, LAR modding. LAR, I think. You, you, you me? No, it's not an anniversary. You don't get an anniversary for every month. Thank you for the sub. Happy 15. It's got too many anniversaries for things. Yeah, they, they are really well done. I believe I believe these are on itch. Well, I'm just happy you, you know, deemed me important enough to show up today. I appreciate that. Not not every day we get a 4B in chat. So thank you. Trying to see. I think these were on itch. That's right. I'm somebody. Bill snowed in. That sucks. Yeah, it's it's hurtful, isn't it, Steggy? Like he's at home all day yesterday, and as soon as I raid into lead, he says hello. He doesn't say hello during my stream, but as soon as I raid into lead, he says hello. LJR, sorry, LJR. Here we go. Copy. He is a cat napper. So there's those hoop barns right there if you guys want them. Got some cool stuff in there. Eighty six. Holy cow. So yeah, if you want those, those are there on itch. I think these are gorgeous. He also made this one. Pretty simple. But still, kind of nice. It is color selectable. So. I don't know if the hoop barns are color selectable. I didn't check. They are color selectable. Oh, let's see what we got. All right, we got outside trim. Oh, just outside trim. Looks like all you can do. Hey, I mean, it's something. It's going to be a white hoop barn, but you can put the trim in. Yeah, I think these things are awesome. I love these barns. No, no supermarket simulator. No. And what, what game are you looking at? All right, lastly, because we have to fling something, chat. Richard sent us this. Oh, I, haven't, I haven't heard of that one. It's a refrigerator. It's 800 bucks, which I don't know if that's good for a fridge. Seems kind of overpriced for this fridge. I mean, it's not a Sub-Zero or anything. What's up, lead? Up eager.
Now, you know, wait, where's our spawn point? You know, this is a Richard production because it has simple IC. I don't know why you make a fridge have simple IC, but it does. I think we got some cakes and things in there. We've got milch. Right, Jed? I'm with you. It's got too many fruits and vegetables in there. Look, Eager, it's got Coke. You can have all the Coke in here, Eager. I think there's a steak in there. Is that a pork chop? I don't know what that is. Yeah, lack of... I don't know what that is. That's a malt. Next to the Coke. Filts. I don't know what kind, but it's a malt. The bunker missiles. That one is on itch as well. Let me see if I can find that one for you. That one I had to scroll back quite a ways for. It might take me a second here. Where was that one? I don't see that one. Don't eat my cake. I'll, I, I'm, hey. Better eat it because it's about to get flung. I know they're on itch. Oh, no, wait. They were, they were not on itch. They were on the third party sites. Right. If you, I'm not going to tell you which site it was on, but if you play cards, if you play cards, you know what, what mod site it is. No, not that one. hundred bucks. All right. It's it's on the third party sites. I can't find it. It is by Pavel and Takanov. 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 Storage metal. Pavel and Takanov. There you can find it. So yeah, we got a fridge. Don't know why we have a fridge, but you can't pick it up. Which means I can fling it. I know what you're talking about, Richard. I mean, I don't think it's realistic. Oh, dropped it. Where'd it go? Oh, it went backwards. Oh. That did not fling. Hopper gifting a sub to Richard. Don't do don't give Richard subs. That means he's gonna come back. Alright, it doesn't fling! Richard, we sent me a mod that doesn't fling. Take that sub back. Dare you, Richard. I know. Very disappointed right now. Oh, that kind of flung. Kind of. Yeah, it's got to fly. It works better down at the bottom end here.
Yeah, that's that's disappointing. All right, yeah, we got to strap it to a trailer here. Hold on. Oh, put it in a cannon. That's a good one. Try that. Fart noises and catapults, chat. FNAC. What I do? Oh, that worked. Uh, let's reset that and tilt that up. Where'd it go? Where's my fridge? Oh, there it is. We're not high enough. The FNAC works for fart noises and cannons, too. What's up, Mad Max? Yes, this is Farming Simulator. That's why it's in the title. There you go. Swing in a fridge. I wonder if Indiana Jones is in the fridge. What's up, Henry? Oh, there you go. We have a fling or a cannonable fridge. Yeah, we uh, we kind of break the boundaries of what you can do in farm sim. That's why we're the bad boy of farm sim. I don't want someone to send me that clutch cardboard cutout so I can cannon, cannon the clutch cardboard cutout. I don't know if anybody, you know, in the chat, like Eggman or B, has the uh, clutch cutout that I could catapult. That would be nice. What's up, Legacy? Oh, this doesn't have straps in here. Not strapped down? Well, that sucks. I can't customize it. I don't own it. Does this not have straps? Let's try that. I thought it had straps. We'll try the bail, the bail version. There we go. That has straps. If we can actually catapult this thing. Nope. This thing is resisting everything. Yeah, the fridge doesn't catapult. What am I supposed to do with it? Oh, there we go. All right, technically we catapulted it. It does. Two hours later. Yes, I know, Lee. Ad's about to start, chat. All right, so there you go. Perfect time to end mod time. We've got some uh, beautiful legacy barns. 
We got a selection of trailers or sheds for you. Awesome hoop barns, missile silos. That one has got length, not girth. And then of course the the showstoppers there. No, I'm not cannoning the cat. Then of course our cold storage. These things are awesome. You're definitely gonna want these when they come out. Send me some stuffs. I'll show it off. There you go. Well done, Legacy. Your foot's asleep. Uh oh. Let's hear, uh, let's hear big guy sing. Tony's my time. It's my time with Tony. Me, I'm Tony, and these are the mods. My time. <laughs> 